Okay, in this video, I'm going to talk a little bit about the settings and how you can start up your Chromebook so that way it works best for you. And this also applies for uh, if you're using Chrome on a Mac or a PC. So I'm going to go ahead and go over here to the three lines. That's your menu button. It says Customize and Control, Google Chrome, and I'm going to go down here to my settings. And when I go to the settings, uh, one of the things that's nice is how you start up. Now, right about in here, on if you're on a PC, it says on start up. But on a Chromebook, you have to scroll down and go down to where it says show advanced settings. When I'm here, and what I'm going to look for is look for the words on startup. And you have some options here. You can have it start up to open a new tab page, or you can do it where the next time you open it, wherever you left off, it'll open up on that exact same page where you left off just by selecting that. And then my favorite is opening on a specific set of pages. I like to have my pages set up that wherever, uh, whatever tools I use most frequently pop up first. That's what I like to see. So actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this a couple of different ways. I'll show you the first way. The first way is to just set your pages the way it is. I'm going to X out of that one so you see how it comes up the first time. And I'm going to do mail.google.com because I want my mail to come up first. I'm going to hit OK. And now it is set. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you another way that you could do it. You could type it in like that. But another way is to type in your pages that you want. So I'm going to pull up my calendar here. And I'm going to pull up my favorite blog and let's say I want to add these two pages let's say I'm on these pages I want these pages to pop up first I'm gonna to go to my settings and I'm gonna find that on startup button give it some time to load scroll down find my advanced settings On startup is right here I'm going to select set pages and one of the fancy things that you can do is you can pull up your pages on different tabs that you want and you can just hit use current pages and when you do that boom it adds them whatever pages you are using now if you have pages up that you don't want to use then what you can do is you can X out of those I don't want this one and I don't want that one but I do want these two I'm gonna hit OK and now when I start up Chrome it's going to start up exactly on those pages, which is very, very handy.